Uh, my name is Fiona Asonga. I run the Telecommunication Service Providers Association of Kenya. Before I answer Vinsaf's question, I had input for the earlier question raised by Mark Tim. In Kenya, I know that there's a university of technology called the Jomo Kenyatta University of Agriculture and Technology. It is, <coughs> it is a leading uh, university when it comes to ICT training. And they have a program called uh, Bachelor Degrees in Business for Information Technology. One of the modules in that program is law. And in the law course, they study policies and laws that have been uh, formed around ICTs, the internet and use of telecommunications. So yes, there is a way in which, in response to Makutin, there is a way in which uh, the universities are trying to bring in governance issues and policy development into the, the technology program. That is one example. I know there are many others, but I don't have the statistics. Then in response to Vinsaf's question, why are we paying more attention to the internet than to telephones or the fax machines or uh, previous communications uh, uh, devices that we have had or, or facilities we've had in the past? I think partly because the, with the internet, there was much more uh, integration of services of activities and it's touching on lives in a more greater impact than the telephone did. For example, in Kenya, prior to 2000 when we had the mobile phone, there were only about 200,000 phone users. With the mobile phone, we have close to 20 million telephone subscribers just mobile phone subscribers. What that means is there's a change also in our behavior as consumers in the way we adapt the technology. Most Kenyans receive internet via their phones because the enhanced phone is easier to buy and cheaper to access than a laptop. The cost of a laptop in comparison to the phone there's a big difference. I can get a phone with internet for, for example, 6,000 Kenyan shillings or 5,000 Kenyan shillings. But to get a laptop, I'd have to have about minimum of about 25,000 Kenyan shillings. That's like five times the price difference. So the phone is easier to get and it's easier to get internet on the phone and to do a lot of things on the net via the phone. The concern about the internet is that if I have internet on my phone and I'm putting a lot of my public information on the phone and via the phone and also receiving e-government services via the phone, then there is concern. First of all, because of the amount of data we are now putting onto that network. Secondly, the type of data we put onto that network and the kind of transactions that have to be handled on that network. We have, in parts of this world, economies that are running on the internet and some environments that are completely paperless. And that raises concern. And that is why we have to sit here and discuss governance issues because we need to continually develop standards that tie into how we manage this internet resource because it's now a resource we can't avoid, we can't ignore, and we have to live with.